Bonjour class, today we are going to make an elf. Uh, there's a holiday coming up uh, pretty soon, uh, Noel. Um, I hope you can follow these directions step by step and enjoy. Um, we're gonna be using the techniques that we've learned this school year as far as shape, um, color, line, and space in order to create our elf for Noel. All right, I hope we have a great time. Look forward to uh, creating this uh, artwork with you. I see the whole paper and put your fingers, your hand in the middle of the paper. And then where your middle finger starts at the top is where we're gonna put our first shape. And our first shape is gonna be a triangle. young in French. Next, we're going to add his hair, la cheveux. There's three curly lines or curvy lines on the left side and three curvy lines on the right side. Uh, it's symmetrical and symmetrical means having both uh, being equal or the same on each side. Next, we're going to do the inside of his hair and uh, the curvy lines again. All right, and then we're going to do a half circle silk underneath. That's going to make his face. And then two circles for the eyes, de silk, small silk circles, small circle for the nose, and a half circle for the mouth. Next, we're going to do his collar. He has a distinct collar. Um, it just goes out like this curved line out like this curved line. It's a pretty big collar. Um, then it goes down and down. We're doing the same thing on each side and up and over. So this looks like an upside down V shape. This looks like a V shape and you, this looks like a V shape. These are all pretty much triangles. So next we're gonna do his uh, shirt and uh, we'll just use a square shape uh, for the shirt. Don't close this in just yet. And then we'll do a, a sideways square here for his sleeve and a sideways square here for the sleep. All right, now we're gonna do le bras, the arms, and that's as simple as two straight lines, two straight lines, and then the hands, la main, our curly lines again, one, two, three, four, curly lines, one, two, three, four. These don't have to be perfect, but I think, um, they look pretty, pretty good so far. We're gonna do the belt buckle next. Now it's time to do the belt buckle. We'll do a square. That's a shape, big square, smaller square inside of it, carré. And then we'll do a rectangle on the left side and a rectangle on the right side. Now it's time to draw la jambe, la jambe, the legs. But before we do the legs, we have to do a large W shape and that W shape uh, is gonna create the bottom to his uh, elf top, his shirt. And then the jam are just gonna be straight lines. Elves wear tights. All right, we're almost there. What are we missing now? What are we missing? The feet are gonna be super fun. Um, this is gonna be my most fun part. So this is an L shape, and then we'll do a backwards L shape. All right, and then we'll do a D shape and a C shape. All right, and then those will come back around like this curved line, and this will come back around like this curved line. So he has really big feet, all right? It's pretty cool. We have our L. Last but not least, we need to do a background and the background will have like curvy lines, which kind of represents like some snow. Usually uh, Noel has snow on the ground and then we'll do some buildings in the background. And these are just gonna be 
big squares or rectangles. Rectangles. Smaller rectangles. And larger rectangles. And this is just gonna make it look like a city background. There's a famous movie called Elf uh, that has Will Ferrell in it. Um, it's more there. Then we can do smaller shapes like squares inside. These will represent the windows. 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 And then we can color this in. That's our lesson for today. Hope you enjoy. Thank you very much. And you can color this in. That's our elf.